Hi guys, it's Monica. I'm going to share with you a couple of wigs. Actually, I'm only going to share one right now and I'll share another one in another video. But I have this really, I think it's a really awesome edgy style, edgy color. Very different than a color I would normally pick. So if you, uh, if you want to take a look at what I have, which I'm sure you will, right? Stay tuned. The Wig Company. I know many of you know The Wig Company, right? It is, it is a company that really has a ton of different brands that they offer and from high end to moderate to lower end products. So there is a wig for every wig wearer. So if you're into like say extensions or perhaps you have, uh, you want to wear a topper or you want to wear a bun or a braid or ponytails or anything like that, the wig company pretty well has a little bit of everything for every style, every woman. And more importantly, I think every budget. So anyways, I've reviewed a number of their products before. And I, and I will tell you that each time I, I get a wig from them, I'm, I'm overly impressed again. You know, I'm just, I look at the, pro, the product they send and I look at the features they have and I'm going, wow, this is so affordable and there's so many different color options. It's just amazing. So anyways, they asked me to review a couple of wigs and I decided I was going to pick one from the Statements line and one from their Fashion Club line. So the one I'm gonna share with you, the Statements line, is a little bit outside my comfort zone. The color is like completely different for me. I, I consider it to be a super edgy color, <laughs> but I like it. So anyways, I haven't put it on my head yet, so you'll see it on me for the very first time as well. But the Statements line, if you're familiar with that, they, um, that's, that's, a, that's a line that is very, very modern. And I'm going to use the word edgy because that's actually what they have on their website as well. So it's an edgy, fun, they have all these cool colors and, you know, just, just different, different styles. From very classic styles to very cutting edge to very modern. They have rooted colors. They have... Um, what they call uh, ombre and flash colors, and they have products that have monofilament caps, they have some lace fronts, they have some that have permity, some that have very minimum. They actually call it um, completely different. They don't call it perma tease, they call it perma lift. And if you are a gal like me, a little bit of perma lift I need in my life. I don't need a lot, but I need a little. So I really, I mean, I picked this color and I said, holy mackerel, this is really a different look for me. So I'm going to share it with you. This is actually Essence. And this is, like I said, in their, their statement line. So they call this a very classic everyday bob style. And I fully believe it. It has a monofilament and it has a lace front. I'm going to show you. First of all, even though I've opened this up, I want you to see how it's packaged. It comes inside out, totally pinned inside this package. And, you know, it's secure. It's just a really, really awesome presentation. I've already unpinned it just so I could take it out so that it wouldn't take forever but for me to open it. But anyways, like I said, this comes with a, a monofilament. It's got like a, a monofilament here. It has a lace front. So I want to tell you a little bit about their lace front because... When you look at this lace front, you'd never know from the price point, right? This is a really well done lace front. And the lace on this lays really nice. So I'm gonna turn it over because the color, let me see. This is Essence in the color F394. And the size is average. This is a heat friendly fiber. You can see the part is still in here, the crisscross part. So you take a wide tooth comb. I haven't done any of that. I'm just going to do it with my fingers. And you want to comb it down. But just take a look at the fibers on these. <laughs> I think I'm going to be a little bit of a, um, I don't know, fashion eater, something like that, whatever you call it. So what I normally do when I get a wig... Some people, you can spray it, right? You can spray a wig with water. Um, I sometimes forget to do that because I just don't think of it. 
So I usually put it inside out, then I put it right side out and I just shake it. Now, if I was going to be reviewing this and I wanted to just put it on my head, I probably would have done this for a day or something just to loosen up the fibers, but you don't even have to do that. So if you have a wide tooth comb, which I do, you can go through here, you can gently rake through these fibers. Now this is heat friendly fiber, so you want to be gentle with it. But, oh my gosh, I just think this is really cute. I love this color. Rachel J sees me. So I'm gonna put this on my head and I'm gonna share it with you so you can see what it looks like. Hang on. I'll probably superimpose a little bit of the shaking and how I put it on so you can see what it looks like when you first, um, you know, first put it on your, your head. So when you first plop a wig on your head, it's like everything is all over the place. Now again, this is directly from the box. So I want you to keep that in mind, all right? What you're seeing is directly from the box. I haven't even cut my label off. The label is still on. And um, I basically, you know, used a wide tooth comb. If you can pick up a wide tooth comb like this anywhere, be very, very gentle. This is heat friendly fibers. So let me just show you a little bit. Let me just tell you a little bit more about this particular one. Uh, Essence is a classic wear everyday short bob style. This wig is designed with a monofilament lace front and hand tied lace front and sides. It gives a real natural appearance. This is verbatim what they're saying on their website and I have to totally agree. I think it does have a real natural appearance. And I love the fact that it's heat friendly synthetic fibers and it only, and it's short. So it isn't gonna, it isn't gonna have that wear and tear rubbing on my neck or anything like that. But you can style this. If you want to put some curls in, you can style it. All you have to do is just get a, um, you know, something treated with heat, but low heat. And there's a little bit of permalift, hardly any at all, hardly any at all permalift. But there is a little bit here, and I think that just gives it shape. Just <laughs> gonna turn around so you can see that. Again, I've got my tag on. What do you think? <laughs> I think this is cute. So, um, let's see, the weight. 2.6 ounces, the length in the front, three and a half. And so absolutely, there is like little wispy bangs or fringe. Now, if you're a super fringe person and you really would like to have a lot of fringe, you know, a lot of bangs, you can cut more into this. But I just like a little bit. I just like wispy bangs a little bit. So you've got a three, little three and a, three and a quarter uh, front, four and a quarter on the top, five and a half on the sides. The back of the nape is three. It does have an extended nape, a little bit, a half inch. So these, um, the permalift is kind of all over, they say, but man, I don't feel much, I don't feel anything. What permalift is, is just like little short hair fibers that are intermixed into the section of the wig to give it some body, to give it some life, some style, right? Because some of us need that. We need a shape. I, I have that type of a head. I've, I've often talked about how my flat, my head is flat. And, uh, and I need some help. So it does have a side part. You could probably play around with that part a little bit. Again, if you wet this um, and style it with a little bit of water, you might be able to do that. I'm not feeling or seeing any, you know, for coming just out of the box. Um, I've done no, I haven't done anything for any shine. I don't think it's excessively shiny at all. I don't have a ton of flyaways. There are some, but hardly anything. And I, I don't know, I think it's really, I think it's really nice. What do you guys think? So I'm going to superimpose a close-up of the inside of the cap right now so that you can actually see it. I think the most important thing for you to see on the cap is the fact that it does have a monofilament side part. 
and the nylon and the monofilament and then the hair tied fibers around it are very, very fine. It's a fine grade. It looks really nice. The fibers are heat friendly. You can see that there is a lace front and that's also a fine grade. Now, I will, I will say that the lace front on this particular one is really superb. It's awesome. It's awesome. So it's an extra fine grade nylon which has also got hand tied fibers all around it. The, the look is just really nice and it's very stretch ribbon lace. The foundation of the, of, the, of the wig I think has a lot of stretch as you can see here. You've got your velvet, your velvet lined ear tabs so you've got a comfortable band that is sewn in the front side and on the, on the underside of the wig. So I really like it. I think this is perfect and I think this color is going to be super fun. Super fun color. I think the lace front looks really nice. And I'm going to show you some outside shots. Thank you so much to the wig company for sending me this. This again is Essence. And this is just a really pretty, pretty piece. Part of their statements line. Edgy look. Perfect, I think. I think it's a perfect look. I am loving this. Thank you so much.